Do you want to carve a pumpkin this Halloween? Here's how you can make that happen easily in Blender. First, add a cylinder and change the vertices to 24. Go into Edit Mode, switch to the Loop Cut tool, and click in the middle of the cylinder to add a loop. Press S on the keyboard and scale it up to make the width of the pumpkin. Press the 2 key to switch to Edge Select Mode and switch to the Select box by pressing W. Hold Alt and select one of these edges. Then hold Alt and Shift and select every other edge. Scale it up a bit to give it that pumpkin look we're all familiar with. Press the 3 key to enter Face Mode and select the top face and press I to inset it. Press S and then Z to scale it on the Z axis to flatten it. Then move it down a little bit by pressing G and then Z on the keyboard. Repeat those steps with the bottom of the pumpkin, but push it up instead. Now we're going to make the stem. Click on the top face and press E to extrude it up a little and scale it down just a tad. Then extrude it again two more times, scaling it and positioning it like this. Now in the Modifier tab, add a subdivision surface modifier with two on the Levels viewport. Press Tab to go back to Object Mode and right-click and click Convert to Mesh and right-click again and press Shade Smooth. Go back into Edit Mode and Alt-click this ring of faces. Now press Ctrl Plus a few times to select the full stem. Press P and separate selection and go back to Object Mode. Now select your pumpkin and in the Materials tab add a material and make it orange. Do the same with the stem, but make it a dark green. Now, if you just need a pumpkin, you can just add your materials and you're done. For the rest of you, stay with me. Add a plane and rotate it so it's where the carving is going to be and move it out in front. Press this little button to make the viewport face the plane. Or you can use numpad 1 or 3 depending on which way it's facing. Now, go into Edit Mode and select the Knife tool. This is the fun part. Draw the face and press the Enter key in between each part. When you're done, press 3 to switch to Face Mode and select everything that's not going to be part of the carving and delete it with the Delete key. Back in Object Mode, add a Solidify modifier to the pumpkin to make it thick and set the thickness to 0.1. Also add a Solidify modifier to the carving mesh and drag out the thickness until it goes into the center of the pumpkin. Finally, we will carve the pumpkin using a Boolean modifier. Use the eyedropper and click the face you drew. Right-click on the pumpkin and click Convert to Mesh. And now we can delete the face mesh to see our spooky little dude ready to be lit up for Halloween night. For the render, Make sure you're using Cycles, GPU, and click this button to go into Rendered Mode. Add a point light and make it yellow and crank the brightness to whatever feels right. If you end up carving your very own pumpkin, post it on our Discord to show our community what you've made. Link is in the description. If you enjoyed this fun tutorial, Please share this to those friends of yours who want to get into 3D but haven't made the leap into Blender yet. This could be the video that gets them to enter the wonderful world of 3D.